Okay, another watch you strap in. And uh, yeah, this one, well, for those who don't know, this is just a quick watch of the day, basically, and the strap that I pair uh, the watch with. Just to show, it's not a watch review. Um, if I have one on a watch, um, it'll probably be up a natural review, or this one is has yet to be made. Uh, I'm just breaking it in and, and really getting a feel for it before I put my opinions on this one. And uh, I'm really loving it. Uh, it's a great watch. Um, pretty darn accurate. And it uh, pairs with a lot of things, uh, but I'll get into that in the review. But today it is uh, the NTH Nakin Renegade again. Um, and this is on a seatbelt. I believe the material is like a seatbelt material, uh, NATO strap, and what is referred to, they call this color um, ice gray. Um, yeah, it's really like a, a light blue or an ice blue, I would say, more than a gray. It, doesn't, it sure is a lot of blue in it to be considered gray, but I think it pairs up nicely with this watch, especially with that dial, as you can see. It's very dynamic, as I've talked about before and shown in other previous uh, videos. And it just, you know, it can hit those, what I would consider ice blue or uh, maybe even a blue steel kind of color on that dial. You can see, right? It's got that kind of silvery, grayish, blue, light bluish <laughs> uh, color that comes up. It, it does a lot of things. It goes into a, like a deep blue gray and certain angles too but um just playing with the uh yeah what i consider the the steel bluish color that's in this dial and i think it works great uh with this pairing um yeah i think uh it's dangerous to pair i'm not saying it's dangerous but it's not the best i think in in my opinion to overly color match straps with dials or if you have like a strong blue accent on a watch for instance like a navy or you know a, a pretty deep blue and you know you put on a navy or a relatively same colored nato strap or perlon or even a leather strap it's an obvious choice and it, it does work but it's a little bit predictable and boring usually but um in some cases like this i think it works because that at least that blue is is kind of subdued and it's not always there and of course it, it gradiates and fades off towards the edges as you can see uh so it's not as uh it's not such an overpowering color on this particular watch head uh, you do have like uh, some white and black accents as well and of course the silver but overall um yeah i think this looks pretty darn good it's great uh um it's pretty much what I imagined it would look like. The blue isn't too far off. It's actually a pretty darn good match. Uh, you know, the NATO, that, that light, what they call ice gray, but I mean, it's really like a light blue. It really matches quite nicely. And uh, I think this makes a great uh, summer pairing. Um, you know, something bright and vibrant uh, for summertime. And uh, it could probably work for winter too, but I'm, I, I, my mind was thinking summertime. Uh, so that's basically it. Uh, Hope you guys like this uh, i think it works pretty good if you have any other light blue dial watches you might want to consider this oh by the way the strap is from uh, cheapest nato straps uh, i'm not being paid by them at all although i seem to have a lot of them they just offer great prices and generally their strap variety and the quality is pretty good um, there's only w at least one exception that maybe they've improved on but i'll get into that later but uh, yeah, uh, no, I buy all this stuff myself, uh, so it's not being paid whatsoever. Uh, and this, or even the watch head, all, all the stuff I show is, is stuff that I buy, so, and I like. And if I don't like it, I'll probably say it. Uh, but I've, I usually try to avoid negative comments and, and bad reviews necessarily, you know. I want to keep things positive and, and, and encourage things that I do like versus throw out hate and why you should avoid things. And unless I, you know, it's, it's a very strong... Uh, subject uh, but anyways uh, that's it uh, have a great weekend see you later